the chocolates. What the frick is that? We got the chocolates. Don't they do dad jokes? <laughs> we got the chocolates. Wait, there's a podcast? Yes. Really? <laughs> Scouts, welcome back to the We Got The Chocolates podcast. I'm Lee. I'm Skin. And I'm Gertie. And that is Yana over there. Hello. Yana, you're playing an integral role tonight, actually. There's a big responsibility for you coming up. So I've heard. Yep. <laughs> Which you've been very excited about. Uh, to do with the relationships with significant <laughs> others uh, at this table. So Not between us. No, not between us, no. Uh, we, Mick is away, as you might have noticed. He's in Bali, which Gertie is frothing. Mm-hmm. Sent me some lovely photos today. <laughs> <laughs> you said it looked like a prison. <laughs> Those photos that. did look dreadful. They're, yeah. like, <laughs> like, they're not the photos I've seen of Bali everywhere. No, else. three steps further he's in yeah. a fucking bear trap. I yeah. don't think that Vickers should be in charge of tourism for no. Bali. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, here's a big pile of dirt. Yeah. Yeah. Like, why is there electrical wires on the ground? Yeah. <laughs> uh, but Dave the Brit that knows jack shit, he's over there. He's editing. Uh, Charlie, who fact checks any ridiculous claims we make, is here as well. You're probably right by accident, but definitely stay for a laugh. Uh, story from the weekend from me. Uh, I was coaching a wicket keeper in mm-hmm. cricket yesterday um, and it was at Holland Park, so just a lovely little community club where he's played cricket for his whole life. Mm-hmm. Uh, and we finished the session, hour-long session, and uh, I was early actually. Okay, right. You were uh, not. Oh, well, on time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so like 10 minutes uh, yeah. late. Yeah, I arrived at 3 to 10 and it started at 10. So it was perfect. Okay. Um, that's good. That's not bad. Progress. Yeah. Anyway, after the session, uh, a guy came up to me and was like, he said something, but I didn't really hear what he said. I don't know if you've ever been in that situation where you sort of try to guess and like fill in a conversation. You didn't just ask him to repeat it. No. Okay, <laughs> no, that's, that's, that's fine. not really yeah. my style. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. hate awkward conversations. <laughs> I prefer yeah. to just like make it up. Okay. So he said something. It's unsure. a choice. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, uh, and I was like, yeah, like because he was at Holland Park, I just assumed he was asking a question about the kid I was coaching. And so I've given him like a five-minute rundown on how the kid's session went. Mm. I was yeah. like, yeah, caught really well. It's an awesome little yeah. keeper. We did this drill and this drill. And this was really cool. Uh, how did you guys go? Like, how was your? Because he had his two, no, nah, the twin daughters there that mm-hmm. were doing like the girls' program. And yeah, he sort of said, "No, nah, yeah, we had a great time. Like, the girls have just taken up cricket. This is our first time at uh, at Holland Park mm-hmm. at this junior club." And so then I was sort of starting to think, like, I don't think he really was asking about <laughs> that keeper then. <laughs> and uh, and I was like, "Oh, okay, awesome, man. Oh, that's great. Great to see them getting into it." Anyway, I'm Lee. Very nice to meet you. And he was like, yeah, I'm Curtis. I watch your show all the time. Oh, <laughs> I was no. asking about the show. He was asking about oh, we got the chocolates. And I gave him a big yeah. sermon about this 15-year-old oh. kid that keeps at Holland Park when he doesn't even like cricket. <laughs> That's so bad. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I think the lesson is maybe ask the clarifying or question. Or listen just a bit better. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, you know how sometimes in your life you'll just – randomly get a flashback of something embarrassing that's happened. Yeah. I think that'll be mm. one of them. That's yeah. definitely one. I just got one of them listening to that story, which still terrifies me from my childhood, so that was nice. Please you know, share. <laughs> people, some, I was down at Touch Footy and some bloke like, waved. I thought he was waving at me, but <laughs> turned out he was waving at a guy oh, behind me. And I didn't realise until after I'd had like a five-minute conversation with him thinking, I don't um, really know you that well. <laughs> that's because you don't. <laughs> I was trying to work out, why would he have started a conversation yeah, with me? Sucks. Where do I know this guy from? Never <laughs> click. And then I I'm walking away and he just walks up to the blade bar. <laughs> That's so fucking weird because yeah. you don't want to talk to anybody, man. <laughs> yeah, I, I think, I, no, but that was when I was very young. I think now I don't want to ever talk to anyone because of that. Because yeah, you're scared. Yeah. Oh, that might be it. That, yeah. that might be the whole point. thing. Yeah. And that would be the same for me, thanks to Curtis. A big shout out to Curtis and thanks very much thanks for listening to We Got the Chocolate. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, let's Sorry get- about Lee. <laughs> He's just quick cricket too. <laughs> Poor guy. He was so bored of my oh, conversation. Oh, you talking about you? <laughs> I should. You should, actually. Uh, let's get on to joke of the week. We've had another one sent in on the chalk line. Skin selected this, actually. Mm, I'm excited. Okay. I like, yeah. it. I like it. Yeah, yeah, right. Excellent. Well, let us be the judge of that. <laughs> let us be the judge of whether you like it. <laughs> Makes sense. Here we go. Hey, guys. I got a good one for you. Uh, why can sea lions only swim in salt water? It's because pepper water makes them sneeze. All right, cheers. Take it easy. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. I'm so close to quitting. <laughs> That's really good. That's good. good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm catching off guard. <laughs> Definitely caught me off guard. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, guess what you think about it. <laughs> Cause, uh, cause I was thinking no, no, no. We got a joke, mate. No, no, no. I'll no. oh, explain it well. Uh, Chris. <laughs> 
Uh, Skid, you got a written one? Yeah, I do also have a written one. Comes in from Lucas. If you, if you didn't like that one, I'm nervous about this now, but that's all right. Uh, where does a poor Italian live? In the spaghetto. <laughs> That is absolutely for serious. That's, that's one of my least favorite ones. I'm so sorry. Thank you for sharing the joke. But that, so yeah, that's not great. Right. It's not it's actually, great. Yeah, the Italian Elvis impersonator used to sing that song. Oh, yeah. In the spaghetto. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if that's a true story. No, no, no. Anyway, uh, I'll stop selecting. Joke, joke of the <laughs> week. Joke of the week brought to you by our friends at Better Beer. Thank you very much mm-hmm. for that. Uh, and sorry about skin selections. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Your turn no. to go, Mitch. <laughs> <laughs> Skin just loves that beer. Yeah. I mean, I don't blame him. I'll be- <laughs> I just, yeah, I spilled my beer everywhere and went full panic stations and tried to, <laughs> tried to cover it up. Tried to clean it up. And there it was, was actually a guy in here waving at him, but yeah. he, was, he was actually waving at Cody. He's waving yeah. that sign. Yeah. No apologies. Uh, we've, Gingus, I feel like you've said a bunch of times recently, like encouraging people to leave a rating and a review mm-hmm. for us, saying. I think you, I said every week. I'm yeah, pretty much it. every week. Yeah. You say, sort of I've heard it once effect. or twice. Yeah. <laughs> what's the effect of if you leave us a good rating, we'll be sure to read it out on, on an episode at some stage. And, um, yeah, in, in devastating news for everyone that sort of listened to you, we got an sort of an audio review on the chalk line oh. today, uh, which I, I just think trumps all the written ones, to be honest. So, mm-hmm. uh, yeah, it's, it comes from Reese, And just for a little bit of pre-context, he's the bloke that pulled us up on not calling Dave the Brit who knows jack shit by his full name. Okay. Mm. Real stickler. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay. Play it, please. Boys, I'm back. It's Dave the fuck alls, mate. I just wanted to say that your performance over the last couple of months has been outstanding. Now, I know you guys hand out friend of the show cards. I can't hand out friend of the people cards, but if I did, fuck, you would all get one. Your commitment to the Dave the Brit shit, I'm all over it and I'm all about it, and it's been absolutely outstanding. All right, I know, look, whether you're going to put a compliment in the podcast, neither here nor there, I know some I'm sending this to you on a – on a Monday morning and when you record and the likelihood of you guys being able to pivot and do something like that is fucking just absolutely <laughs> oh, unlikely. This might get true. in there in four to six business years. <laughs> just wanted to give you a shout out and see you doing a fucking bang up job. See you next time. <laughs> I like him. Yep. So that's, uh, yeah. That was nice. That yeah. is good. And I was, I really wanted to get in this week because that was this morning. He said that this oh, morning. Nice. So you actually did pivot. We did pivot. Holy yeah. dude. I, I found it that is this possible. afternoon. Yeah. That was, I was so excited. I was like, that's I can amazing. still do this. Well done. I mean, it took well me four done. hours. Yeah. But I mean. <laughs> well done. <laughs> mm-hmm. Reese has, has he actually applied for a friend of the show? Can't no, he hasn't. Any? I can't find an application for him, but he keeps contributing. Does he have so to apply or can we just make a – Slide in the back door, sort of like I did. Well, we can definitely send him a pog this week. Yeah, sure. Oh, we got the chocolates pog for our podcast. So, Reese, we'll get your address off here. Four yeah. six business years, that'll work. Right. <laughs> Three five. Yeah, we'll be in touch. But um, in our written reviews, a few trends have sort of been emerging that have confused me. Firstly, Lethal, you pointed out people leave us really nice reviews with low ratings. Yes. Which I don't I don't understand. So I think it's because Goaty always says five star. They just like they're uh, like the naughty kid in the class with Goaty as the mm-hmm. teacher. Okay. Or whatever right. he says to do, I'll not do. Right. Oh, okay. Give us one star. Right. <laughs> <laughs> now all the good kids okay. are gonna give us one star. <laughs> That's why teaching's so hard. I mean, two and a half, half stars. Two teachers. and a half stars, guys, everyone. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's just it's so weird, really. Like always here for a laugh. Love the banter, cricket chat, and joke of the day. Great stuff. Mm-hmm. Two stars. <laughs> Thanks, that's, that's, that's a fail. That's like below that's average. Like, imagine if you were like a hotel chain or an Airbnb. <laughs> you would not be like the like comfiest stru- bed, unbelievable mini bar, one and a half stars. Great <laughs> service. Concierge was phenomenal. One star. Would recommend staying here yeah. and half a star. Yeah. <laughs> what? No, that's where Mickers is staying. <laughs> Uh, so there was that, and then there's also people that leave like low, low star ratings and say that they'll change them to five stars when we complete some sort of challenge. Yeah, right. Uh, so we have to give a shout out to. Oh, like Woody, when you got your Woody Johnson and Heidi. Pierced. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So yeah, so someone someone fixed that up for us. So and yeah, apparently if we give a shout out to Woody and Heidi, we'll get a five star one. And go to you've got to name a test eleven of like puns, pun names. Oh, is that my challenge? Yeah, and then a five star. Yeah, if you okay. prep, prep that for He's us. He's not going to do that right now, is he? No, nah, probably not right now. Well, you oh, seem to. He seems, he seems I did the, I did the rugby it. league thirteen while I was sitting in my kid's sand pit. So I mean, anything is possible. That's true. Mm. Mm. Off yeah. you go then. <laughs> I'm busy. 
<laughs> he needs to be in the sandpit. Yeah, it's <laughs> my thing, place, it's his place to be. <laughs> okay. in there. Uh, I am going to get us on to uh, nicknames for mates now. We asked you to share the best nicknames for your mates. We've done a few of these uh, segments, and every time we put them up on social media, they just more and more keep coming in. Uh, so let's roll a few of these out. Now, again, important to clarify, we didn't invent nicknames or the concept of going through them on a podcast. Uh, however, uh, these are the ones that I saw for the first time this week and they gave me a huge laugh. So hopefully they do for you as well. Uh, however, I actually wanted to start with a few from our own life, um, which I, these are the ones that I've, I don't know if I've invented them, but definitely the ones I was proudest of in my life. <laughs> Nervous. So uh, I worked with a girl named Terry. Obviously, uh, um, her nickname was Dactyl. Oh, I thought mm. she had to get a wrist. <laughs> oh, oh, my geez. days. No. <laughs> no. Uh, all the one dinosaur themed, actually, because we also worked with a girl named Sarah, and her nickname was Triceratops. So they were two that I was very, <laughs> very stretch. proud of. Yeah. Uh, and then, Skid, you remember this guy? I still don't know his full name, but we put touch footy with a bloke uh, who I really thought his last name was Alphabet. Oh, yeah. Benny. Uh, actually, Charlie knows him as yeah. well. Benny Alphabet. And everyone, like, kept calling him that, like, Alphabet, Alphabet. And I was like, that's kind of a weird surname, but, like, happy yeah. to get around it. No worries. You know how when people have nicknames, you just don't question yeah. them? Again, yeah. like, the start of the yeah. – I should probably ask more questions. I'm like, yeah. yeah, I, I was going <laughs> to bring that up. Stop just going but... off on a whim and, like, nicknaming fucking random people you don't know. <laughs> no, no, fucking no, hell. The, people were all calling him Alphabet, yeah. and, and we were just, like, assumed that that was actually his name. It turns out I still don't even know what his real name is, but it was, like, Wisniaki or something. Yeah, yeah right. and Alphabet was just because oh, he had brother. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. no, no, it wasn't the Aki, oh, but yeah. yeah, just Alphabet you, because he you had. Don't know why? No, because he had like every letter, very long now. last name. Yeah. Oh, last okay, name yeah. 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 He reckons his other mates also called him Wi-Fi because his name looks like a, a Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi password. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just, that's disappointing. <laughs> very creative. <laughs> oh, like uh, we uh, we played. Um, uh, cricket is actually a professional cricketer mate of ours, um, Mark Stichetti and Meatballs. That's one of our nicknames for him as well. Yeah. <laughs> Why is he so angry at us all the time? <laughs> he loves this segment. Yeah. He gets so angry at us all the time. Skid doesn't use nicknames. He only speaks to you in just like real formal yeah. language. <laughs> he called me Sir when I walked in here actually. <laughs> his nickname's Skin. He's too scared to give anyone Anyways. else one. <laughs> Press it sticks. <laughs> Welcome, Miss Yana. <laughs> Shut <Thanks>. up. <laughs> Have you got any for us, Skin? Uh, no, not from my personal life. No, no. Oh, my God, that's a long document. Yeah, Jesus oh, no. Christ. We've, We've been, been through that. plenty sent in, so I can rattle off a couple if you want. First one, it comes from Alex. Okay. I've got a story for the Nicknames Coworkers segment. My dad's name is Ron, and many years ago he worked on a team with another guy named Ron. This other Ron was much bigger and much dumber than my dad. So to differentiate, <laughs> to differentiate the two of them, they call my dad less Ron and the other guy more Ron, as if to confirm <laughs> their decision <laughs> to call him more Ron. He never quite picked up. On why that was his name. Yeah. <laughs> very good. Very good. Actually, it reminds me of those two guys that were sitting on the cliff, remember? And one bloke, fall, one bloke fell off. You know why? No. Actually, wait, I think I've screwed this up. Okay. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I love that. That's fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we'll go through that again yeah, at some okay, point. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, oh, right. One of the guys was moron. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad I went through with it. <laughs> yeah, I just loved it. <laughs> Down the house it's the worst delivered punchline ever, but it still worked beautifully. <laughs> and that goes uh, to show it's not about the journey skin, it's mm. about the destination. Yeah. Remember it's, that. It's not correct. But <laughs> it's uh, not true. Yeah, All right, so I'll go up from Tom. I used to work with a guy called Reese who did nothing but moan. So we called him the Mona Reeser. <laughs> Very good. That's very good. I like it. Yes, I like that. <clears throat> I met a dude called Rice because his name was Barry Matthews, a.k.a. Baz Matty. <laughs> <laughs> That's genius. It's so good. The level of creativity. <laughs> That's very good. I'm just amazed because I feel like, especially in uni, you go through this age... Where you get nicknames so easily. Like we had a guy in our class who mentioned one time that he really liked burgers. So he called him burgers for like three years. <laughs> not very creative. But no, then you have know, stuff yeah. like this and yeah. you're like. <laughs> yeah, these yeah. are the ones that should be sticking. Yeah. yeah. Right. It makes you jealous, doesn't it? Because yeah. yeah. really does. yeah. people are like, why isn't skin, skin? I want to yeah. be that creative. Yeah. 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 He shaved his head Once. when he was three. Yeah. <laughs> very <Once>. creative. Yeah. <laughs> he came out of the womb bald. He wouldn't read out. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, well, on that train, I like this one. I used to I used to call a girl at work. <clears throat> I used to call a girl at work Krakow 
Her name was Dawn. Dawn. <laughs> <laughs> no, I also like this one skin. A sparky I knew looked like Elton John and got called Socket Man. <laughs> hey, that was very good. Oh, I love Elton John. That's so good. You do love Elton John. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> There's still plenty more. There's so many. There's so many. Pick your best guy, nines. Yeah, literally. Guy at my wife's work had the nickname Hip Hip. His name was Hugh Ray. Can't be real. His name's not Hugh Ray. His name is Hugh Ray. No. No, no, no. No, no. no one's named Hugh Ray. <laughs> No one's named Hugh Ray. No, no one's Hugh named Hugh Ray. <laughs> no. None no, of the eight no, some weird, no way. There's some weird names. <laughs> no, nah, they made that up. <laughs> Charlie, can you fact check that? <laughs> What's he going to fact check? Look at the WhatsApp. Facebook. Just Facebook. There's just three. With There's Laurie three on Moore. Facebook. <laughs> All right. Well, your job today, after we got the chocolates account, is just a Facebook message and say hip hip and see if he gets it. <laughs> If he responds back, honestly, on air, can you let us know, please? He's getting a, he's getting a punk. <laughs> he can have the show. He can have the show. <laughs> Give him where you got the chocolates at headquarters. <laughs> then my fucking microphone. Crikey. <laughs> I was about, I'll, try, I'll try to tell Lethal this one earlier. He didn't get it. I'm hoping someone else does. Okay. There's a rugby union player in the UK called Billy Twelve Trees. Nicknames 36. Oh, two or three. <laughs> See, when you say that loud, it's way better. <laughs> 12 trees. Like 12 times three. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's really good. It took me a minute, but that's very good. Yeah, all right, it's good. You finished. Come on, close this out. All right. Guy at work lost seven fingers, so we called him Godfrey because he's only got three, three fingers. <laughs> well, the one with threes are funny. <laughs> What? Well, the one with threes in it. I know. I got three fingers. Oh, no. <laughs> You've got one more as well. <laughs> it's my favourite one ever. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, it's a real guy. Now you put your own nervous. It's, it's a really guy. It's a real player from Man City back in the day. Oh. <laughs> Do you want to read it? <laughs> yeah, sure. Okay, sorry. Man City had a player they called Kiki Masumpa. <laughs> Kiki Masampa. Kiki Masampa. So they called him Chris. Chris Masampa. <laughs> Now, this is the most nervous I've ever been for a segment, I think. Nervous but excited, um, and you'll see why. We're, again, sort of targeting the little quirks and idiosyncrasies that make us us. But this edition uh, will be the things that annoy our partners or girls that we're getting to know in some people's cases. Uh, our significant others have sent in lists but to other people at the table. So, like, <laughs> Eloise has sent her list to me. Kathleen has sent her list to me. Rochelle has sent her list to Skin. Yep. Uh, so we don't know what they're going to be. And I we think just, we've got a fair idea. <laughs> we're just, sort of, just going to ambush each I other have with an them. Idea. Yeah. And Yana, your Keep role going. here, uh, you will be uh, just deciding whether they are fair grievances yeah. or not. Okay. But I feel like you've already Where done do you, that. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> I feel as though, yeah. I know what do you think is about she, to happen? Yeah, what sort of fence she might be sitting on, I think. Yeah. Right, yeah. It's funny because reading both of your two lists, yeah. uh, which took a long time, by the way. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, well, I, well, actually, saw, I saw Kathleen writing the list today. I was home for lunch today and I saw her write, like, uh, probably a longer list than what Skin does for this podcast. But <laughs> I said, oh, what are you doing? She said, oh, I'm just writing the list. But Lee asked me to. So, oh, fuck, it's long. She says, yeah, I've actually cut some out already too. <laughs> Well, I'm really She'd nervous. done some editing. <laughs> I'm really nervous because Eloise was texting me and she was like, I'm about to send this list off to Lee, but I just want to check this one and run it past you that it's all right. And I was like, oh, no, nah, please leave that one out. Like it's it's very embarrassing. And then like, now everyone wants maybe, to know that. Maybe oh. 10 seconds later, Lee walked in and he was like, I cannot wait to read your list out. I was like, oh. It's I, in. I think it might be in. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's Eloise do it. Sent I'm a so full, ready. A full note. She said a separate note. <laughs> Actually, okay. a wedding bell. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Who wants to go? But I, I can read for one of you two first. Uh, who do you have a yeah. preference? You, want nah, to maybe paper you start us off with who? With Cody. So oh, okay. that I, oh <laughs> we're just throwing so each other on the bus. I get some time to work. <laughs> Again, it's so funny because there's so many on your list that I feel like I will also get sprayed about. Uh, your first one, Goaty, uh, not putting his keys slash AirPods away in the same place the and worst. then spends the time wondering where they are. No. <laughs> Is there a bowl or a home Is, for both of those items? Press the button. <laughs> 
we got a sting for this as well. It's like, well, I hardly see how that's my fault. <laughs> Cody, mm-hmm. is there a, a spot for both of these items in your home? Oh, vaguely, I guess. But again, <laughs> Las would Vegas. your wife say that there is a spot? Mm, so, yes. For the keys and airpod you're talking about? Yeah. 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 Uh, <laughs> I think she was. <laughs> I've got a feeling. <laughs> Good up. deflection. Yeah. <laughs> um, there is. Okay. Yeah. So hard, I think you know. Sometimes, if you know you what I'm know. saying. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, let's get the skid because are you, yours. You're tit for tat, are you? Oh, well, this okay, comes with right, photographic okay. evidence. Oh no, oh, no. <laughs> it's the Prince Albert. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to see it. <laughs> Skin's yeah. annoying habits. Doesn't fold tea towel over the rail. Just sort of stuffs it <laughs> no. in. No. Example <laughs> image below. <laughs> that does look horrendous. Why? Doesn't it? <laughs> it's quicker. <laughs> does the same job. <laughs> I it does. <laughs> you just got a, it it just doesn't dry. No, it doesn't dry. Yeah, but just get a fucking new one then. <laughs> oh, do you do the washing? Yes, every day. Every Skin? single day of my life. Do you do the washing? Every nah. couple of weeks. Absolutely. Every month. <laughs> Four to six business years. Yeah, when, Absolutely. When the bed sheets get washed. Yeah. Yeah, okay. No, that's <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, that's not my best. Play the button. <laughs> Oh, I mean, yeah, but obviously, obviously not my fault. <laughs> we can't do it after oh, every one. <laughs> after every single one. There's too many. Post, Dave. <laughs> All right, come on. All right, Lethal, I'm, I'm very keen to hear your defense for this because this just doesn't sound like how, how you could how you could rationalize Here's my this. Defense. Well, how they say that's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty empty. <laughs> like little jingle after it. How you could come to this decision just doesn't make sense to me. So apparently the other day Lee hung wet clothes out on the line. Good on you, mate. Very good. Very good. Okay. Very good. On top of the dry clothes. <laughs> <laughs> Rather than taking the dry ones off the line for us. <laughs> This is simple. There's no fucking way anyone's doing that. No. Why would you do that? <laughs> Cricket Why was on. Did he do I that? Think- <laughs> no, no, don't you ever dare compare yourself to me ever again. I that think is- I'm done. <laughs> What are you doing? What do you mean? No, can you take the button off that one day? Because that is your fault. No, 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 no. Keep your fingers to yourself, buddy. I. <laughs> no, no, no. I genuinely, I, I actually, can't I don't that. know what to say. No, that's absolutely. I don't ridiculous. really have a defence. I did do Why? that. Why? Because you, you know what, that. hanging yeah. hanging clothes out is it's an effort. I, I'll give that to you. It's mm. not, it's not a fun job. Mm, yeah. It's just what you do, though, isn't it? It is just what you do. Well, so. I did a- <laughs> Not well. You doubled your work. That's because <laughs> now the next clothes are going to dry as well. <sighs> it's concerning. <laughs> Not good. That's uh, really badly. Well, <laughs> let's go to another one. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you better. <laughs> Uh, is that the time oh, already? Yeah. Oh, this segment is just flying through. Yeah. Anytime one of us is under too much pressure, well, what about that thing? Yeah. <laughs> okay, Skid, when there is a set time that we have to be at an event or a cinema, Mitch thinks either that's the time to start getting ready or the time we have to leave by, not the time that we actually have yeah. to be at the event. Hence, we are often late. One time we were supposed to be at a friend's house at four <laughs> and he hopped into the shower at four and was giving himself a head massage like he had hours to get ready. <laughs> It is interesting though, Lee, that you are outing him for punctuality when that is yes. not your strong yeah. suit. Yeah. No, I was going to say, there are, things on both, houses, yeah. there are things on both of these lists uh, and the two things I've read out so far, well, I don't, probably the tea towel one <laughs> and definitely the AirPod thing or yeah. the keys, I get sprayed about that every day. Every day I get sprayed about. I'm busy. Where's my keys? You put them in the same place. <laughs> like, oh, yeah, sorry, I forgot. I'll do it next time. Yep. Uh, and then, yeah, definitely that one. Um, if there's mm. a time given, that's like, I, I feel like it's a ballpark sort of. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. A, it's rough. It's, it's rough. rough. That's an estimate. Oh, okay. I couldn't disagree more, but anyway, I keep moving. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's fucking infuriating. It's just, you just need to get a bit more organised. Yeah, that's fair. I, I think, really do. But no, my, my problem isn't that I think the time to be there is the time to start getting ready. It's just or, that you don't care. It's, no, it's that I... <laughs> I massively selfish. underestimate how long it takes to get ready every yeah, time but, for some reason. But starting to get ready at four. Oh, yeah. Well, that's not bad. 
That, I mean, that's not good. Sorry, that is quite bad. <laughs> okay. I think my defense for that day was I was running late to get home from somewhere. So and then like, a head the massage I, was called So by before. the time I was getting ready, I was already going to be late. And I was like, oh, it's an extra May as well give massage. myself a head massage. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stop saying head massage. Yeah. Yeah. Body to I, was that. Just, <laughs> I was just washing my hair. That's it's literally what yeah. yeah. Anyway. All right. uh, Gody, mm-hmm. Kathleen then just said to say loofah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and get you to guess what that means. Oh, well, she had a go at me, mainly when she was pregnant, but then, like, this is the themes continued, like, when, like, you used like, Luther in the shower, right? Yeah, like, Martin Luther King. Martin yeah. Luther King, obviously, yeah, that yeah. we called him Martin. <laughs> um, I usually just throw Martin on the ground. <laughs> Like instead of like hanging it up on like this fucking little tiny thing where it barely stays up there anyway, most of the time it falls down anyway. So I'm just cut out the middle man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the Kathleen. That no, says- also I'll defend myself a little bit as well. <laughs> Quite often, like, like you know, I've got kids and they jump in the shower. I mean, like, well, I'll sit down in the shower and play with them, like they loofah and stuff. So I'm not gonna like you know. Fucking, I'm busy. <laughs> not going to stand up to get out of the no, shower. I roll out, quickly try and dry myself before my kids start throwing so buckets what, of water on the floor. What, what you're actually saying there mm-hmm. is that you just want someone else to do that job for you. No, but see, the thing is, well, you're going to use the loo for anyway, aren't you? Yeah, yeah I mean. but it's not nice mm. to be laying for it to be laying on the floor of the shower. That's of the clean kind of, shower. It's kind of gross. Yeah. Why do you clean a shower? Because it's gross. Because it gets gross. Yeah. No, you don't I want your loo for on there. So what you're saying is you're just too lazy to pick it up and you're just expecting what I'm your is most lovely- of the time it's just falling down rather than me throwing it on the <laughs> It's room. gravity. Uh, it's gravity. gravity. If it falls down, yeah, it's true. different. You but if, if it's gravity. your carelessness, all you're doing is adding more to your wife's workload and that sucks. Well, I hardly see how that's my fault. Uh, <laughs> think about that. Okay, beautifully. <laughs> yeah, I've yeah, um, yeah. then got the message from Kathleen that says, after he explains it, tell him it was on the floor again today and he now gets to share outside. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Skip, we got time for one more. Love you too, honey. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Behind my 10. <laughs> 30. I just want to, okay. One more. I wanted to bring this up because I'm, like having lived with you growing up, I, this has always been the case and I don't understand what happens. When you shower, you just somehow manage to get the entire bathroom wet. Mum used to call you a performance seal this or something. This is a male Literally, thing. That was, mum called you a Yeah, but the thing seal. is as well, like he's got an extra limb to carry out of the shower as well, remember? <laughs> <laughs> he means my it means arms. arms. Oh, yeah, like three arms. Bigger arms. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. good point. <laughs> okay. But what what happens? Do you just... I I understand. He's not that Do you hairy. Off. The door <laughs> open or I've never been able to work this out. I don't know why it happened. I still, I've never. It started. All showers have always had doors. They're just like, yeah, that's what most. Your mum used to no, hate. But if you have one of those bathtub showers, bath mat. With the bath mat gets drenched. Yeah, like, along with everything else, so wet. Like, and I can't. Work so do out. you shut the shower? Yeah, the doors yeah. closed. Like after you've finished the shower, do you just like give yourself a quick little like? I think it's because I have like this habit where <laughs> it's pretty weird. <laughs> I have this habit where where I'm standing like I kind of shower. You know how some people just shower because they just go in, wash themselves, get out, like just to get clean. I sort of it's my place to think and sing yeah. and stuff. So yeah, right. I find myself like standing there sometimes, and I just go like this with the water and like put it against the wall. Can I just so- stop, <laughs> stop? Stop. So you're telling us two minutes ago, no idea why. And now you're Cuffing saying water. I play with the water. <laughs> God, you said water. No, but I'm throwing For the- those not watching, he's, <laughs> he's flicking the water. For I don't know how you would describe what I'm doing with my hand. It's like and throwing it. It's a second serve in tennis. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. NBA 2K for us. High-fiving the water. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what happens because I don't do it at the door, but then it always ends up real wet outside the door. <laughs> So someone has you, to you someone has flicking. to look into that. You know, it's Con- condensation. Yes. Oh, man, I have to do everything around here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you must be flicking it too high. It's going over the roof. It's not very tall, <laughs> so that would be. Fine. Yeah, that does explain. It's a big you feat. <laughs> I prepared that one. That it's so it's that, yeah, that actually Michelle loves every single time she will ask me to like do something. Like <laughs> <laughs> she like she could have cooked like three meals <laughs> in a row, and she'd be like. Ellie, do you mind just quickly yeah. washing up your plate? Oh, I have to do everything around here. Can you just check if the doors are locked? <laughs> She's a saint. She blows She's up. She's a saint. It's the easiest way to get her to just. <laughs> I 
just get <laughs> angry. Is that funny to you? No, like, it's just not. Yeah, well, it is kind of funny because she was saying like she kind of laughs. She kind of laughs at it. But do you, then if do you, you do then the wash room, your dish? Yeah. Yeah, okay. But if I was That's to do funny. it at like the wrong time, I think she would Could actually explode. Could yeah. Be bad. Yeah. You got to read the room. Yeah. My fine. Um, I think the summary is. And you simple. are an expert at that. <laughs> I took it to Kathleen today. Can you bring the bins in today? I have to do everything around here. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's literally, yeah, you should all be doing it yeah. to your significant yeah. other. They love it. Yeah. Yeah. It's not that funny when you when you do do yeah. everything around here. Yes. Yeah. yeah. yeah no, Matt never says that to you. <laughs> <laughs> Matt sounds like a good bloke. Yeah. 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 You don't Probably have any bad stories about Matt. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, Next episode. Okay. Okay. I'll prepare some. Okay. Yeah. Actually, go He's not here to defend himself though, so it just feels like bullying. Yeah, let's get him. Which it kind of is, which... We'll get him on the next episode. Go to you actually speaking of, you wanted some rebuttal at Kathleen because she does have one. Oh, no. Yeah, there's just one thing. And, like, it's not just me that knows about this. My my, my mate on my right-hand side um, knows about it. Kathleen's com- communication skills using her mobile phone are, I've heard this. are quite, good. quite uh, poor, shall we say. Mm. So it's not only her her uh, text messages were like, so, like, I'll go to the shops and she'll say, like, can you pick up the camel from the ship? So I'm just like... <laughs> But what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> like, so like it'd be like, can you pick up some custard from the shops? Just, no, I don't know. I don't know where the fucking camel is, mate. I'm not on a ship, so so I have to decipher that while I'm walking two children through the shops. But anyway, <laughs> but the main thing is, <laughs> when when Lethal used to stay at my place a fair bit when we were going through uni, like Kathleen. You know, I've been together for a while. We weren't living together at the time. She might be back at her parents' place, and Lethal would just crash in my place after training or on Wednesday or. Friday or Monday or just whenever he felt like it, basically. <laughs> most nights. Most nights, yeah. He just yes, sort of lived yes, at my yes. house randomly. But anyway, so like we'll be driving back from training or whatever and I'll, just, oh, I'll ring Kathleen and she's like, oh, hey, Dale, hey. Actually, we will, well, we prepared we did, a quick we role prepared, play. We did, prepared, prepared a quick role play. <laughs> <laughs> so, so you, I'm Gertie. You be, and I'm Kathleen. Yeah. Right. That's confusing. Why would you not be? I can't do Kathleen like he can do Kathleen. And I don't mean anyway. <laughs> <laughs> No one can. <laughs> From what I've heard. Stop. Right, okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. okay, I'm yeah, I'll be my wife. All right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so Skid, can you do the you be the phone? You be the phone. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do you watch? You, watch. Right. you just yell at us for a second. I'll just watch. Right. Yeah. Uh, ring ring. <laughs> hey Dal, how you going? Yeah, not too bad. What are you guys up to? No, we're just um hey, we're just no. <laughs> Is this fridge open for a reason? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, well, I was just going to get something out of it, but I just didn't know if you needed it or not. Still there, Dal. We're just here on the phone. Hold on, we're just on the phone. <laughs> hey, Dal, what's up? <laughs> That's genuinely that not exaggerated. And the first time Lee heard it, he's just like, what the hell? I said, oh, mate, like, I'm just, yeah, whatever. I'm just getting yeah. else. So I'll, yeah, I'll Has speak, she I'll always speak. done that? Oh, for as long as I know. She doesn't do it that much anymore because we obviously spent a fair bit more time here. But like when we weren't them together, honestly, it was fucking tough. <laughs> just trying to ask you if like, you need something from the shops took 45 minutes. Why would she answer the phone? It's like, don't answer the phone if you can't no, Oh, talk. mate. How about this? Oh, time. mate. I would lose it. I <laughs> Sitting we'd there ring, in the passenger seat. Yeah, we'd ring her on purpose for no reason. I said, what's this? Mum, is this where this goes? <laughs> it's the greatest thing ever. <laughs> oh, yards. Yeah, I'm good. moving us on. A, a segment that you introduced to the show uh, is Blame the Algorithm. Yes. The, the algorithm's always right. Nice. I was happy to go with this. So right. Oh, fuck. <laughs> there is our mate Mikus. Live from Bali. <laughs> Oh, he's lost a shoe. <laughs> um, blame the algorithm, yeah. It's yeah. basically what we just talking about, some of the intriguing things generally that are yeah. uh, coming up in our For You page or what else are they called across other social media platforms. Shoot. Just what are being Home served page? to us. I don't know. Page. I guess you it's what? Like explore page? Yeah, yeah. Instagram explore page. Isn't it? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. So, like, and just seeing if you have, if you listening share any common interests with any of us. Mm. So, Yarn, do you start us off because yours is always far more interesting. <laughs> I don't know that the algorithm is working for me and yeah. reaching its targeted audience. <laughs> what have but you got? I have found this girl and I, I need to read out her account name just to give her credit because it's brilliant. Okay. Reb Massel, I think is how you say it. <laughs> She's a lawyer in the States and she reads out court transcripts <gasps> of some of the most outrageous things people have said. Wow, that does sound interesting. It really does. Yeah. And yeah. 
It is so funny. It's like <laughs> someone talk Phil. No, Phil was, I oh, my it. last uh, YouTube uh, Instagram search was a uh, Hugh Ray. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, my my explore pages have decided that I'm David Attenborough in yeah, training, nice. and they just keep serving me animal attacks. Oh, or, like as in that's an, scary. Animals attacking each other though. Yeah. So it'll be like Komodo dragon versus a massive python, and like just those two just so self hunting each other. <laughs> To each other, and then they've got like the like yeah, it'd be like crocodile takes on wild buffalo or something, and it just keeps like giving me these animal battles that okay. So, really so how did I just click the search button to this? Is that right? No, no, it's just literally like what comes up in your. Oh, yours is weird. Yeah, like in that. Oh, you get a lot of golf videos. I've, I've I've get three types of video: golf number one, cooking number two, and then uh, uh, semi uh, attractive uh, <laughs> ladies. Um, so that's obviously for someone yeah, else. I, I, no, I had no idea how that popped up there. Yeah, yeah. Right, okay, good. Yeah, that's how you go with this. Uh, yeah, good. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Judge, what's the name of your business? Defendant, I have an OnlyFans. Judge to the court, what's an OnlyFans? Public defender. Um, it's a video where you post, it's a website where you post videos. Oh, wow. Okay. How much money do you make on there? Um, I had $300 in my account, but once I get my phone and they find out I was locked up, it will skyrocket. <laughs> like they're just, they just. What? <laughs> why, wait, why is yours always to do with prisons? <laughs> <laughs> you, you are on prison talk, aren't you? I don't know. Yeah. I think once one thing's come, comes from the other, but, yeah. um, anyway, very funny, worth looking up. Okay. There's like about that. 40 compilation videos of them and they are. How is she getting, is this cases she's. She lives in Florida. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Interesting. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, fine then. Just getting anything what? interesting? Yeah. Well. <laughs> Mine are like some weird combination of things that have already been said. So, firstly, I see <laughs> prison uh, talk. animals <laughs> reading <laughs> in prison. Oh, in animal court. <laughs> okay, no, maybe I've got that backwards. <laughs> maybe Crocodiles things that have already been arrested. said are weird combinations of things I've seen. So, okay. part of my feed for ages <laughs> was like. Buffaloes with only feet. No, was like an, animal stuff. How do you hit a draw <laughs> with your hippopotamus? <laughs> Can you just give me this? Shit? Sorry, <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> God, sorry, sorry. No, no, to explain myself. <laughs> okay, come on. Go on. So okay. I'm around. So, not animals fighting, but a lot of a lot of adam, animal content. Uh, so I'd, I'd see like underwater footage of the Everglades in Florida. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Like yes. Yes. Park. Oh, wait. I think I know what you're saying. Yeah. Yep. So yep. you'll see like these really nice like underwater footage, and you think they're just exploring something perfectly innocent, and then it'll sort of keep swimming through and zoom in, and there'll be like. Pfft, 15 alligators yeah. hovering oh. under the water that this person's just swimming. I've with. seen this. Yeah. What? Yeah, I don't understand. Like That just, actually sounds cool. Sorry yeah, for that. I mean, cool, Everglades but... look across my face. There <laughs> <I> said that. <laughs> Is this the same guy that like goes for a walk in the middle of the night and it's like in the, what's their equivalent of like swamp or whatever? Yeah. And yeah. he just looks for, he calls them swamp puppies and they're like giant alligators and yeah. he gets so close to them. Yeah, I don't He understand. picks up snakes like what? he's I, barefoot. This is one guy. Yeah. 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 I assume- I don't know. I assume they're less aggressive than crocodiles. <laughs> They'd have to be. Yeah, he just backs himself to swim around. Hey, hey Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> and then, can you look up a few rays? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then, okay, the other one I've seen is uh, like on Twitter. You know how Twitter's now got like some version of TikTok you can scroll through? Oh, For yeah. Whatever reason, every video I start on, which could be like a, a – politician talking in mm-hmm. like, like in a debate or something like that and then you scroll God, through within intriguing. like <laughs> like whatever it is like you start on some some innocent video within like three videos you're watching a fight like just people are fighting a fight yeah, a I physical like punch a, up yeah like a brawl i don't yeah, understand right. oh, okay. there's just so many of them on Twitter for some reason. Yeah. okay Media. i've got yeah. typically okay. crocodiles are more aggressive than alligators this is from charlie bother mm-hmm. thanks charlie uh, which makes crocodiles more dangerous than alligators that is a good point mm. yeah. <clears throat> alligators are opportunistic feeders Mm. Okay. Meaning uh, that you're not likely to chase you down. They're not likely to chase you down unless they're provoked. However, that certainly doesn't mean that you should swim with them. <laughs> I was going to say, I feel like that feels like provoking them if you swim up to 15 of them. Uh, we're playing Taboo, the game of word guessing with a twist. In Taboo, you describe a word to your partner without using the word itself or five related words on the list. For example, my word here is spa. I can't say relax, swimming, facial massage, or pampering. I will be on a team with skin, as per usual. Godi and Yana, they are on a team together. Yeah. Uh, if you do say one of the Taboo words, you will hear this sound. <laughs> Thank you, Charlie. You've been on fire tonight, Charlie, ever since that Hugh Ray time. Yeah, how's Hugh going, by the way? <laughs> New phone, no Hughes is. No, it's um, <laughs> no, it's uh, that Hughesy you were thinking. Uh, yeah. yeah. I've got a jingle. 
You know that I need a guess from you Cause every word I say is a clue The word could be eggplant, snow or cute Baby, we're playing, playing the game, game taboo Nice sound, fade it down. Let's Has Mika always sounded that bad on that jingle, or is it just yeah. no? It's yeah. been pretty ordinary. <laughs> <laughs> Don't think it's been re-recorded. Yeah, so. the jingles always suck. Yeah. <laughs> Trademark of the show. What app number are we? One nine six. Uh, one nine four. Fucking hell. Yeah. We'll get Still one, bad. We'll, yeah. get, we'll get to F- one nine six. F- oh, no, so. <laughs> no, we'll get to good jingles. <laughs> yeah. oh, right. I wouldn't have thought that, mate. Yeah. Um, all right. Is there, uh, mm, each person takes a turn in describing this 30 second timer. Team with the most correct answers wins, as you know, and you can pass. Are we doing the point to the other nah, team? Nah. Just can be you scrap that. You can only pass once, we yeah, said, I was didn't we? Say pass yeah. once. Oh, Ooh, yeah. nice. I don't know if we usually do that, but mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure that's what we do. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, who's describing first? Cody? Gingus. Your time starts when you hear the timer, which will be now. Oh, you go for a rest on a couch, bed, uh, 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 bed. Okay, the the top of the um, uh, pillow. Okay, and that rests on the mattress. Oh, um, oh, Uncle Toby's oats, um, muesli, mm-hmm, cereal. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, Ooh, you mix it with maple syrup and uh, mm. oatmeal, mm. Um, porridge. Oh, nice yard. Yeah, happy to. Jeez, skin. That would have been big for us if that yeah. didn't get awarded. But I think you've got to give it right. Yeah, yeah. Porridge. I think so. Porridge in. So that's two. Two's nice. Two solid. Good. Two Good. solid. Two. Is. Well, we'll know how solid two is yeah. after skins go. Yeah. There's two more than Michael gets. Two yeah. is generally pretty solid. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> uh, I'm going to start the time and remember that. Skin, you ready? Ah, uh, sure. Three, two, one. Let's go. Oh, no. <laughs> pass it. Just pass it. You're I have fine. Passed it. Yep. Uh, okay. I would say from Japan or in a zoo Kimono. over here, um, a large panda. Bear like. Yeah, nice. Uh, I think it's from China, but. What? That's tough. That's uh, tough. Like an offensive joke of a sexual manner, maybe. Crude. Nice. Oh, my days. Um. Living in. <laughs> it's not worked out. Finish the sentence. <laughs> said to be no local. <laughs> Ricky Martin. <laughs> what did you say? Living, living in, in paradise. Yeah, poverty. Oh, oh. I, I went the wrong end of the. Yeah. Of it's the not end. poverty where you know Bobby's for anyone else. <laughs> okay, so too solid. I'm scared. Dude, Charlie's right. It's, that puts you it's, under pressure. Charlie's is right there nervous. over the yeah. shoulder. Yeah. Yeah. For those who can't see, Charlie's just. Charlie, have you ever neck. had to have you ever had to press the thing yet? The squeaker? No. We, at least we play by the rules. Nice. That's a clean you got a clean game here at We Got the Chocolates, mm-hmm. which mm-hmm. is important for the integrity of very important. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah. Is skillful. this your debut to boot? This is yeah. my debut. I'm <laughs> Hopefully you go better than my debut. <laughs> it is no bracket, isn't it? Oh jeez. Okay. Go. Three, two, one. The the al- <laughs> <laughs> that won't help. No, no, it certainly doesn't. It's the wrong thing. Next button. <laughs> Okay, here That's we go. Now we did that segment already. Three, two. Are you ready? No, <laughs> no she's not ready. Come, come on, skin, work. this is our chance. Come on. <laughs> she's rattled. Make, it, make her go. I oh, know, mate. Okay. Honestly, no, I do it every week. No, this is not. Oh, the word. Oh, no, you already no, see no. the word. Okay. Maybe Three, anyone. Three, two, okay. one. Here it goes. Um, okay. Uh, um, I'm going to skip that. Nice. Just. Okay, it's a kind of... Puppy, uh-huh. very large. Uh, Labrador, a uh, Great Dane. Very large, lives in cold climates. Oh, husky. Uh, American husky, no, Alaskan husky. Fluffier. Oh. Brown, uh, white, white chest, brown ears, drools, oh, drools oh, heaps. Oh, Beethoven dog. What's yeah, that called? Yeah, 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 What the fuck is that dog called? Um, uh. It's like a holy person is the first. <gasps> St. Bernard. St. Bernard. No, I didn't know that. Um, that the was first word was very stiff. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is stiff. Yeah. I wasn't sure. I don't know how you actually can. Yeah. <laughs> I wasted valuable time on that one. Yeah, that's tough. <laughs> that's tough. Cody, while scrolling his algorithm. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Tiger swing is pretty good, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mate. Look, I know Jordan Speed's making recovery. I get that, mate. Uh, All right, are you ready? Come on, Charlie. Yeah. With Count Skin, I think we need. One. Michelle, one. We need, it's two. Mich- all, we need yeah. one. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wow. Three, two, one. Here we go. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay. Uh, the in Harry Potter and they say uh, Ron, they play it in real life. But Chess. It's, yes. 
Nice. Uh, I used to use this when I was a tradie, not getting paid particularly well. Um, Tools. <laughs> and and uh, you Credit wanted to card. make like a <laughs> pavement. You wanted to make a pavement. Another word for that. Cement. And there's a second word. To a mixer. No, it's good to make it too. <laughs> <laughs> You're only one way chicken points. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Four's our high score. Four's our high score ever. <laughs> My first boundary. Literally. <laughs> we need everything we can get. <laughs> oh, great game. Skin, well done. I'm happy with that. Sorry to break your winning streak. No, no, no. Don't apologise. I mean, that's tough one. Yeah. Now, skin. Stiff, you might say. <laughs> that is, <laughs> that is, that is that's a stiff that loss. Is, that is his definition of stiff. <laughs> um, by the way, what do we do with this segment? You're in for a tweet is now a word from your ex. Yeah, that's part of the segment. Yeah. Oh, he's yeah. written down this man, don't worry. Oh, so, yeah. yeah, we got an email from Mike asking, what are you going to do with the segment? Because Twitter's re-band, rebranded to X. We really need to communicate before the show yeah. so I don't steal your thoughts. Yeah, well, you can just read the document. <laughs> 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 he loves his fucking document, that's me, honestly. <laughs> Mike's Mike's got a couple of suggestions. What does your ex say? Or X marks the spot. Nice. Yeah. Okay. So, so when it changes over to X, what does it that has, mean? It has. has it? My app, mm. my mine's, app says X. Mine says Twitter. That doesn't shock me that your phone's not working properly. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me update it live. We're not going to sit here and wait for you to update. You'll do what I tell you to Skid, do. Keep going. Oh my god, there's an X there. <laughs> yeah. So what do we? Quick know, update. What do we call it now? I don't, like, what? Do you, yeah, I have no idea. I don't think we need to decide that yeah. right now. Okay, but yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll decide that. At some point, Build some suspense. Yeah. Yeah. We also Next had, episode. Yeah. There will be a new name. Nice. Oh, why well, make promises we can't keep? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> For that very reason, so that you have some oh, responsibility on you. Yeah, really yeah. Yeah. Skin's, imagine how busy Skin's going to be oh, next week trying to put his tea towel back on the rack properly. <laughs> <laughs> There's so, so much try, I can handle. Trying to write fucking Harry Potter's new novel in this fucking document and rename this segment, honestly. <laughs> Cut, the man. Cut the man some slack, yeah. for God's sake. But anyways, on the same topic, we had a tweet of the week, whatever we want to call it, sent in by Riley about Twitter's Twitter's rebranding. So the first tweet comes from Eric. Uh, Twitter was able to change the logo of their iOS app, but not the name because Apple requires names to be at least two characters. Just some some technical thing you need to know. Uh, Yusuf replies to him, what about X? And then just a space either before or after, like just to get the second character in. And Eric said, Elon already has a company called SpaceX. Oh, that is good. That's really That's funny. Good. That's good. Nicely done. Well done, skin. It's good skin. Mm. <laughs> Look how happy you are with this. <laughs> this I, just didn't oh, I didn't do much. I just read yeah. what Riley said. Yeah. <laughs> good, good, Riley. Thank you very much. Uh, go to you promise. You speaking of promises we can't keep. You promised a super coach update. Yeah. And how long has it been since we've given one? Uh, mm. Pretty early in the season. <laughs> <laughs> Round yeah, three. Look, it hasn't maybe, been, yeah. look, it hasn't been our best. We uh, said we'd be on top of it. That was a blatant lie. Uh, we are, uh, but. Yeah, but uh, we have a uh, we have an overall leader from Patrick. All right, his team's called Daily Enthusiastic. Cherries. Enthusiastic Patrick. 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 Mm. It's a hat trick. Remember your friend um, Patrick actually that wasn't um, able to eat oysters. Yeah, yeah. Because no. uh, they were. Yeah, no. Because oysters kill Patrick. You don't need to finish that. Yeah. <laughs> no, we got it. We got it. No, no, no. Oh, we got it. No, he's leading. Uh, he's in 50th overall too, Patrick. So well done. And Is he? Okay, that's the, in the NRL. That's in the NRL. Uh, and the round score, uh, Ross, Croker for Churchill. Well, camera are going to miss the eight, Ross, but that's unfortunate. Uh, he got 15-22 this week, and that is a shitload. Okay. Okay. AFL skin. Uh, yeah, we got an email from Nathan specifically requesting a super coach. Is he winning last week? Because he's winning. Yeah, yeah good. And Excellent. Yeah, he requested it last week, but he, he's still oh, winning. So yeah, oh, good. he's he's got forty five thousand nine hundred and fifty one points for the season, and I didn't bother to look at who won the round, so my bad. But I can tell you, Lee's coming seventy sixth, and I'm coming one hundred twentieth out of one hundred fifty six. So Pretty good. Just <laughs> dominating over there. Pretty good. <laughs> Is it opposite day? <laughs> <laughs> halfway. Yeah, yeah. halfway. That's me. 76. Yeah. Perfect. Uh, keep playing though. I mean, it's great. And we love it. Yeah. We play it often. Look at I it a lot. It. Goaty does. Yana loves it. <laughs> you join Supercoach next year, Yana, do you reckon? No. Okay. Nice. It's good. I love good that honesty. honesty. Yeah. Good honesty. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you didn't hear me properly. <laughs> no, that's you. <laughs> that's you. You don't listen. Right, yeah, that's another wing of the Chockets podcast complete. We welcome you to be a part of the Chockies crew and get around us on the socials, get in touch there. That's uh, at Wig of the Chockets, basically Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, Snapchat, Twitter, and 
X and Threads. Oh, yeah, it's not Twitter anymore. No, I just downloaded yeah, X. X and Threads, yeah, right. Yeah. Uh, also in those social bios, you'll find in our link tree discount codes to Better Be a Merch and LSKD Clothing. That's both 15% off at the moment. So uh, help us help you by mm. checking those out. Yeah, please do. And you can also help us by contributing to the show. We've had plenty of voice messages sent in on the chalk line nice, this week, which was, which was great. And if, if that's not your preference, you can always write in as well. So keep it coming. Yep. Nice. Keep the ratings and reviews coming. Make them five stars and try not to make us work from if you can. <laughs> 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 Just a straight five stars. Not that difficult. <laughs> But no, we, we might do something to get some more reviews. I don't know what. Make, <laughs> make promises. We make like promises. A promise, yeah. It sounds like something Yana would say. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of Yana, thank you so much for being on again tonight. Outstanding. And everyone can look forward to hearing from you again in a month's, month's time. time. Yeah, yeah, thanks for having me. No, you are most welcome. And thanks for helping us with um, those uh, things. That always get a trouble. joy. Always a joy. <laughs> Every time you Pilot come on, of I, my I feel so much worse about my relationship. Oh. <laughs> I feel so much worse about being friends with Lee, to be honest with you. Oh, right. yeah, yeah, well, that's true. That's yeah. the one, one, what story. was my worst one? Definitely the, the clothes, clothes one clothes. is fucking staggering. To <laughs> <you>. <laughs> that is incredible. That is unbelievable. I've never heard anything like that. Yeah. That feels like that's something that like a 12-year-old boy would do. I don't know. It's worse. Also, in sorry. the end, you end up making more work for yourself. Yeah. That's what I know. It just, yeah. well, that's Future Lee's problem. Too. Oh, yeah, good point. It's yeah. nearly the worst thing I've ever seen. <laughs> future Lee's yeah. problem. I eat Rochelle's problem. Yeah. <laughs> don't, say don't say that. He's only just getting to know, I just remember. Now, yeah. now I'm in the doghouse again. <laughs> Thanks, kid. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, remember that if you are out there asking clarifying questions, if you miss the first initial question or statement this week, then you're absolutely getting the chocolates. It didn't go that well, that. Um, but we will speak to you again <laughs> this time next week. And as always, good luck in the future. And that's stumps. Love you. Love you. Love you. Hey, Elaine. <laughs>